on a roller coaster in a tornado, like going a thousand miles an hour for the first like week. It's insane. For almost three weeks now, Whitney Sutton has been living at UNC Children's Hospital with her five-year-old daughter, Ellie Grace. We came into the hospital March 17th into the emergency room. We had been seeing our pediatrician for swollen lymph nodes. She had really swollen lymph nodes um, and they weren't going away. Family and friends immediately stepped up asking how they could help and wanting updates on Ellie Grace's condition. Whitney turned to Facebook. I was just like, I'm just going to go Facebook live and you guys just post your questions and that way I can answer them instantaneously and everything like that. With daily chemo treatments, therapy, check-ins and port changes, Whitney has enough on her plate. Updating people on social media wasn't top of mind. And God was just like, tell people, like show people that even small things like somebody running back and forth to wash your clothes is a huge help or, you know, just bringing fresh fruit into the hospital is just a huge blessing to us. Whitney's TikTok videos showing hospital hacks like how to upgrade a pull out couch or do laundry have racked up hundreds of thousands of views. I'm back with a hospital sleep pack. And parents on the same journey make sure to say how grateful they are for her tips. One mom said this would have come in handy when we slept at the hospital every night for one month. Another wrote, my son's about to go in for his third open heart surgery, so I need this. It was really exciting to see the response, but also like heartbreaking to see the amount of people who are in hospitals for extended stays and, and everything like that. So it's been cool to be able to be like, just uh, here's the information, it's out there, you know, you know go get this mat so you can sleep like you would at home, it's awesome.